looks like brain mass is early this year, boys. <laughs> <gasps> it's Jumbo Ninja! Ninja, he's a jumbo sized thorn in my side. He ruined my birthday. The way of the ninja is a mysterious one. He has an appetite for justice and cake. <laughs> there must be a secret to his jumbo powers. <laughs> Look, Brian, I'm a ninja. <sighs> that you are, my rotund ringleader. That you are. Wait, you've given me an idea! I did? Yes, I'll fight Ninja with Ninja! Belly <laughs> Bomb! I need to find a better Ninja. I didn't expect to find you here. Let's dance! Your moves are impressive. But no match for a fuck boy. Wow, Jumbo Ninja is so cool. I mean, most extreme emergency teams would give anything to have a legit ninja on their roster. He's so mysterious, like an enigma wrapped in a riddle wrapped in a ninja suit. Does, does anyone know who he really is? I mean, before the alien invasion. I thought he was a seventh grader. I thought he was homeschooled. Yeah. Ninja homeschool. And like, why doesn't he talk? Obvious. He took a vow of silence when the Brainlings kidnapped our parents. He'll only start talking when they're free. Guess the only way we'll ever find out who he is is when we save our parents. Up for more training, Jay Ninja? Ooh, how about Huck Morris 2? Revenge of the Beard. <laughs> Louie, turn that up. Look, I'm causing a disturbance in your precious city. It feels like a trap. And this is certainly not a trap. Well, that's a relief. Ninja's right. Trap or not, we gotta stop Brian from doing whatever he's doing. Please! Why does the dastardly ninja only show up when it's inconvenient? Continue with that minor nuisance. I have some scheming to attend to. Let me introduce you to Super Jumbo Ninja. Hey, hey! He's faster, stronger, and jumboer than Jumbo Ninja! Super Jumbo's my greatest creation yet! The byproduct of a condensed eternity of martial arts training and strict diet of pizza, ice cream, and deep fried butter! I, um. A regular Jumbo Ninja's no match for a Super Jumbo one! Get out of there, Jumbo! Was Huck Morris's five-point exploding butt technique? Oh, oh, I'm okay. <laughs> we can't repel butt power of that magnitude. We need to get out of here. Look at that ninja run away like a regular-sized ninja. <laughs> yes! I've never seen Jumbo Ninja so lethargic. You okay there, old buddy? 
He says, what's the point? He can't compete with Jumbo or Ninja. What would Huck Morris think? Man, this is serious. Sweet just isn't sweet without Jumbo Ninja. But if martial arts movies have taught me anything, it's that when a hero's lost his edge, he needs to go on a training pilgrimage to someplace mysterious and dangerous. Just like Huck Morris in Revenge of the Beard. You guys stay on the lookout for that Jumbo-er ninja. And I'll help you re-unlock your inner ninja-ness. So was that a yes or a no? Do you need to go to the bathroom? Are you sleepy? We'll just assume you're down, okay? Okay. Please! to be on an epic journey to some place far away and dangerous or something? Oh, right. Here we are, the suburbs. Oh, don't worry, man. By the time I'm done with you, you'll be back to your old ninja self. Yellow. Whatever you do, do it quick. Brian and Super Jumper Ninja aren't likely to take this training montage sitting down. Please! Oh. oh. Better, but still not Huck Morris material. Yes! <laughs> I hope Nate and Jumbo wrap up their training montage soon. I can't take much more of it. <laughs> Sweet! Trust me, all those martial arts movies have this scene. You just need to have your ninja vision, your <laughs> ninja vision. Don't take this part of your training lightly, my jumbo-sized apprentice. The one and only. <laughs> What's wrong, my main man? You're usually full of ninja butt kick confidence. Sure, Super Jumbo Ninja's bigger than you. But remember, it's not the size of the charcoal minty flavored ball that matters, but the gooey, partially gelatinated mint flavored syrup that's inside. It's your heart, man. Your heart's the mint flavored syrup. Look, just believe in yourself. Yada, yada, yada. Now go get him, Jumbo Ninja. <laughs> yeah, I was just resting my eyes, Mrs. Johnson. What? Whoa. Looks like someone had a ninja vision. <laughs> yeah, baby. Someone definitely had a ninja vision. The five point exploding butt technique. I think it's high time to mosey on back to the swell mark. Yeah, and not a moment too soon. We kind of need your <laughs> Smells like heroic rematch time, Jay Ninja. Please! Yay! What is keeping that jumbo ninja? <laughs> He's probably too busy crying to rescue his friends. <laughs> Keep doing that! <sighs> I really don't know. All right, Jumbo! Yay, Ninja! That's our Yeah! Dramatic entrance or not, Jumbo's still a few buttered bacon rolls short of being super Jumbo! How about we make this rematch interesting? A wager? Bingo, if Jay Ninja wins, you have to let our team go. And when Super Chain Inch wins, you'll have to take me on a tour of your secret headquarters. You're uh... Remember the gooey, partially gelatinated mint flavored syrup? <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Pretty lame. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because it's a ninja butt strike. <laughs> Failure will not be tolerated. Everything must be perfect for the Emperor's. Intergalactic costume hood nanny. <gasps> you fools! To use punch moguls next to the plutonium ice sculpture to recover it! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> what? Nate? My hated rival? Leader of sweet? Here! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Brian. Incredible disguise, your master of illusionistness. Look, I'm Earth's most wanted criminal, <laughs> Nate! <laughs> Apologies, my lord. Oh. The resemblance is uncanny, and I'm just terrible with disguises, sir. Oh. The real Nate would have to be crazy to sneak into this party. We're crazy for sneaking into this party. Guys, if reading and rereading all 42 volumes of the Intergalactic Culture Customs and Dining Guide has taught me anything, it's that Brainlings are awful at seeing through disguises. Brainlings can't be that dumb. Mm -hmm. Continue partying, Brainlings. Your eminent large of girthness. Your incredible fast movingness. Really? Now remember, we're looking for something to unlock that data cube we stole from Brian last time we were here. Start looking for clues, people. With pleasure! Yeah! Hey! Guess that leaves you and me, Nate. Nate? Their technology never ceases to amaze me, but not cluey enough. Must find clues. <laughs> Um, is the answer party? <laughs> Sweet! Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> huh. Brian's office? Now, if only I knew what I was looking for. Ba -da 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 -da. You know the rules. No one can have a better costume than the Emperor. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> I think we found what we're looking for. Science Universal Remote. On it. Wait a minute. I didn't know they made ninja pinatas. Is it full of sushi? What? I ordered no such thing. Where did that water come from? There's no pipe. Something's not right. <laughs> huh? Human! Other human! <laughs> Ditch them! In the shitty escape plan, Disco Alpha! Wretched children! Find any clues in there. Whoa! Gotta find something, anything. Aha! Brian. Well, well, I've been looking everywhere for you. Your royal hard to findness. Those wretched sweet kids crashed the party. One of them was even dressed up as you. Oh no! Please! Oh yeah. Railings beware. Earth's most wanted criminal, and his minions are making plans in their super secret hideout. Yay! We didn't just confuse Nate for Brainless, did we? We didn't just bring him to our top secret base, did we? Oh, hey, the 
both have pretty good costumes. We need to save Nate. Uh, not that I'm ungrateful for the really posh underground resistant themed party, but why is there no music? Because you're not at a party. <laughs> well, yes, this is an underground resistance party, you're, um, really smartness. And the swellest part of any underground resistance party is when we sneak back into the Brainling base and rescue, uh, I mean, kidnap the Emperor, right? Oh, no, that's a great idea. Yeah, like, totally. Oh, that sounds super! I mean, let's go get those pink goop balls. How hard can it be to sneak back into the palace with the real emperor? Look, I'm wearing a face helmet. <laughs> your large and in chargeness is probably excited to return to your important imperial duties. Yes, totally stoked. <laughs> An authentic Brainling Universal Remote. That's got to be able to crack the data cube. My fellow Brainlings, His Eminent Excellence of Awesome Fashion Senseness has returned to party! Whoa, whoa, what? <laughs> Let's fight the party! Sweet! <laughs> All right, team. Here's that secret back entrance I, uh, um, ooh, read about somewhere in a Brainling magazine. Locked! You must, like, have a key or something, right, Nate? I don't have... I mean, I hear that pink slob of an emperor with great fashion sense doesn't even know what these keys you speak of are. Access card? Nope. Butt scanner? <laughs> Getting it installed next week. <laughs> Password? Brilliant! You know it? Uh, uh, this might not be as easy as we thought. <laughs> Ryan! <laughs> oh, God, yes! Thanks, I could also use the glass of wah. Guess a triple chocolate shake will do? Mm, an intergalactic ruler could really get used to this. That's not really what I meant. Yeah. You guys sure know how to treat an emperor. But I can't help thinking I'm forgetting something. That's it. O'Brien! Your supreme large of girthness. As your supreme ruler, I order you to give me your universal remote. So that I can crank up the Toonskis. Who needs keys and butt passwords when you've got explosions? Laser Lambo! Come on, Resist Tears! What? What? I can't do everything by myself here. We need to work as a team and stop. Come on! Oh. Intruders! Finally! Maybe I'll be able to hurt something! This has to be the right door. I can feel the acoustic vibrations. <gasps> Back for more? Brian! I can't believe you got Brian to play along with this. You'll never take us alive, Brian! Go, go, go! Ah, no! Wretched children! Jetlings! One claw, come on. Yeah. <laughs> Those jetpacks are so hot. <laughs> We're almost at the party. Lily, Louie, find Nate. We'll hold him off. In fact, I've even prepared a speech. How you children could ever dream of besting the greatest military genius ever is not only laughable... Nate, we have to get out of here. 
What kind of galactic emperor would I be if I did that? Snap out of it, mate! How dare you spray doggy drool on Emperor Brainlius the Third? We don't have time for this! <gasps> Ow! Did that work? Yes! Graduated top of my class at Evil Military Genius Academy. You guys brought your party masks? I got an idea. And I was still in diapers. Now cower, you puny children. Gee, is he always this boring? <laughs> Silence! I got to start all over again. Uh, nothing, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> They've escaped you, costume braidlings. Go capture those kids! Man, so dumb. But I still have the mighty, Nate. <sighs> Your incredibly infuriatingness is that you? <laughs> Fool you again! <laughs> so we. Well, team, congratulations on a job well. <sighs> Being emperor's <laughs> hard. Is that where the brainlings are keeping our parents? Wow. wow. This might take a while. What does that button do? And that one? And that one? Great. Then they got my universal remote too. Ah! 